All right, we've got about a minute before we get started. Uh, today you're going to need a mat, a set of light dumbbells, or I've got two pound dumbbells. You can also use <coughs> bottles of any kind, water bottles, wine bottles, anything you've got. A mat, and then I'm not using a chair today, but we are going to go over to a wall uh, for chair, for like the exercise chair as opposed to chair. Um, so if you are not by a wall, uh, maybe see if there's a wall nearby because we are going to do chair against the wall since we don't actually have a bar. Um, but that's it. So just light dumbbells, a mat, and then just be in the vicinity of a wall so that when we do chair, you are you have something to sit against. And that's it. If you've never taken bar with me before, um, light dumbbells is the best call. Um, two pounds will feel heavy, three pounds will feel torturous. <laughs> so um, if you do have water bottles or something, that will totally work. You will definitely feel it. All right, let's get started. We're gonna start with our feet in a nice wide position, knees and toes facing the side. Oh, I forgot one thing. Also grab socks or something. We're gonna do some sliding. I've got socks on. If you've got gliders, awesome. Um, I do, but I prefer to use my socks. I think they slide a little better. Um, so we're gonna be using socks today. All right, now let's get started for real. Knees and toes facing the side. We start by reaching our arms down, then all the way up. Here we go. We take it down and up. Down and up. Keep your back nice and tall. Down and up. Four more times. Four, three, two, and one. Now hold it down. Pulse, pulse. So you're pressing the thighs to the back of the room. Your back is super tall. I'm gonna turn to the side. Notice I'm not shooting my hips back. Pulling my abdominals in. Eight, seven, six, four, two, hold it center. Contract towards your right. Center, contract to the left. Center. So turn your leg parallel. Round your back. Pull your abdominals in and up. Four more. We're here for four. And center. Stay to your left, stick. Right knee pulls in towards your head, forehead, push it back. Pull it in, push it back. So try to get your forehead and your head and your knee to meet. Four more. Four, push it back. And three, push it back. Staying in a lunge, two, and one. Take it through the center, then over to the other side. Forehead to knee, step back. Forehead to knee, step back. So you're contracting your abdominals. Woo, fighting for your balance, clearly. Three more. Three, two, one. Take it back to center. Right leg comes up to a passe, then step it all the way down. Here we go, tempo. Up, down, up, down. So think about bringing that pinky toe towards your knee. Four, two, one. Hold it down, other side. Up and down, up and down. Squeeze your seat so that your knee stays facing the side even as your foot lifts off the floor. Four more. Two. And one. Excellent. Bring your feet parallel. Reach your arms up overhead. Contract over. Reach it up. Contract over. Reach it up. Contract over. And up. Really shaking out those shoulders. Two more times like this. Contract it over. Reach it up. Contract it over. Now step to the right. Release it side and pull it up. Release it side. Let's go a little bit faster. Side, up, side, up. Woo. Four, three, two, one. 
hold it center, right foot steps back, right knee comes high. Right foot steps back, right knee comes high. You've got it, step it down, pull to pass it. So we're thinking about our big toe coming towards the side of our knee. Down, and up, and down, and up. We've got four more, we're here for four, and up, three, and up, two. This time, hold it up, stay in posse, extend the leg towards the front, and bend it in. Extend it out, and bend it in. So our goal here is to keep the knee where it is, and extend the leg from there, out, and in. We've got four more. We're here for four. And in. Three. And in. You got it. Two. Fight for that balance. This time, hold it out. Hold it out. Flex the foot. Pulse up. Pulse up. You've got it. Pulse. Pulse. We've got eight more. We're here for eight. Seven. Four. Two. One. Step it down. This time, left foot. Step it back and pull it up. Step it back and pull it up. Let's take it to the tempo. Down, up, down, up. You've got it. So drop your knee low, push hard off of the back leg and drive your big toe towards the side of the right knee. Four more, we're here for four. Two. Hold this one up, extend, extend, bend, extend, and bend. So again, try to keep that knee where it is. Pull up through the thigh so you can fully extend the leg straight. Four more, we're here for four. To hold this one out, flex the foot, we pulse it up. Pulse, pulse. We've got eight more, here we go, for eight. Four, two, one, step it down, excellent. Roll down, walk out to your plank. Shoulders over your wrists, hips over your knees. Push your hips up to a down dog, then lower down. We take it up and lower down. Take it up and lower down. Two more. Take it up, lower down, take it up. Now hold your plank. Right foot steps forward, right arm reaches up. Right hand down, step back. Left foot forward, left arm up, left hand down. Let's take it to tempo, here we go. Foot, hand, hand, and foot. Foot, hand, hand, and foot. You've got it, step, reach. Step back, step, reach. Two more, step, reach. This time hold your plank, walk your arms to the outside of your mat. We take two counts down for a wide arm push up, two counts up. Option if you'd like to place your knees down to the mat. We take it down for two and for two. Down for two and up. For two, you've got it. Down, for two, up, for two. Elbows press out to the sides. Two more, down, two, up, two, down, two. This time we take it halfway down. We pulse in here for eight, seven, four, two, one. Sit your seat back, reset your shoulders. Walk those arms forward. This time push forward, shoulders over your wrists. Narrow push up, elbows hug in by your sides. Then press up, we take it three, two, one. Press up, we're down three, two, one. Up in one, down three, two, one. Up and one. So your elbow should slide past your wrists. Three more. Here we go. Down. Two. Three. Push up and one. You can do this. Down. Two. Three. 
up and one. Last one, down. Two, three, push up, sit your seat back, reset your shoulders. This time, push forward to a forearm plank. We tap the right knee, left knee, right knee, left knee. So keep your shoulders and your hips in the same line. Pull your lower abdominals in, knit your ribs together. We're here for eight, seven, four, three, two. Now hold it, center we dip. Right, left, right, left, dip, dip. Push your shoulders away from your ears. Eight, seven, four, three. Now hold it, center. We take a side plank, then back to center. We take a side plank, and back to center. Two more. We take a side plank, and back to center. Take a side plank and back to center. Push up to your hands, shoot your hips to the ceiling, pedal out your feet. Bend both knees, walk your feet all the way in towards your hands. Slowly roll up. Excellent, all right, so grab your light dumbbells or your bottles of whatever you're holding. We start with our feet parallel. Our arms reach up to shoulder height. Then we lower down. We take it. Up, then down. Up, then down. So you want to do your best to keep your wrists and your shoulders in the same line every time you lift your arms. Lift up, then down. Up, then down. Let's add a press to relevate. Take it up, lower down. Up, and down. Keep those legs as straight as you can as you press the heels up towards the ceiling, lower down, up and down. We've got four more. Here we go for four. Two, now hold this one up, lower the heels, bend the elbows, back, front, back, front. You've got it. Now notice, my elbows are going straight back as opposed to bringing my hands in towards my shoulders. So keep the position nice and wide. Let's add a bend of our knees. We bend the knees and stretch, bend and stretch. Now notice I'm bending my knees, but I'm not shooting my hips back. So notice if you start to push your hips backwards, try to keep your back nice and tall. Four more, we're here for four. Two, let's put it together first time slow. We take it up, then bend it down. Reach back out, then lower down. Let's take it to the tempo. We go up and bend and stretch and low. Up and bend and stretch and low. You've got it. Up, bend, stretch, low. We've got three more. Here we go for three. Two, last one, hold this one out, lower the heels, flip the palms, we bend and stretch. Now notice, as I bend and stretch, I'm stopping my arms when they get to elbow level. So I'm not taking a full curl and hitting my shoulder with my hand, I'm bending halfway. We add our right foot stepping back for a curtsy in two, in one, here we go, right foot steps back. Back, out. Woo. Drop your back knee nice and low. Drop, out. We've got four more, four. Two, hold this one down, hold it down, pulse it up, pulse, pulse. Eight more, we're here for eight, seven, four, two, one, step it down, pull the arms back, we extend the arms out, 
pull in, out, pull in. You've got out, in. So extend your arms nice and straight, trying to get them back to shoulder height. We add the left foot stepping back for a curtsy in two, and one. Left foot steps back, back, and out. So again, dropping that knee nice and close to the floor. Keep your back nice and tall. Extend your arms a little straighter. Four more like this. We're here for four. Two, hold this one down, hold it down, pulse it up. Pulse, pulse. We've got eight more, here we go for eight. Four, two, one, rest, excellent. Bring your feet parallel, palms face you, slight pitch over. We take a wide row, we pull out and down, out and down. You've got it. Out, down, out, down. Now, if you can, extend your right leg behind you. We lift it up, lower down. Lift up, lower down. Lift, lift. You got it. Up and down. Fighting for the balance, the standing leg stays bent. We've got four more. Here we go for four. Two, hold this one up. Hold it up, arms straight and bend. We stretch the arms and bend. Stretch and bend. You've got it. Four more. We're here for four. Three. Two, hold this one straight. Hold it straight. Arms and legs pulse up, up, up. How straight can you keep your arms? Eight, seven, four, two, one. Step it down, palms face each other. We fly out and in. Fly out and in. You've got it. Out and in. If you can extend the left leg behind you, lift, low, lift, low. You've got it. Up and down. We've got four more. Here we go for four. Two, hold this one up. Hold it up, palms face the front. Extend the arms out. Pull them in. Out and in. So the palms of your hands are facing the front. You're squeezing your seat to keep that back leg off the floor and keep your balance. We've got four more. Here we go for four. Two, hold this one out, hold it out and pulse it up. Pulse, pulse. We've got eight counts, here we go. We're here for eight, seven, four, two, one. Step it down, elbows pull in. Kick back, pull it in, kick back, pull it in. So how straight? Can you extend your arms behind you? Stretch, bend. We've got four more. Here we go for four, three, two, hold this one back, hold it back, squeeze your arms in, squeeze, squeeze. So as you can see, my palms are reaching towards one another. As though I could get my hands to clap behind my back, squeeze, squeeze. For four, three, two, flip the palms to the ceiling, pulse it up. Pulse, pulse. Now, if you can, lift both heels up to a four starch and balance. Pulse, pulse. We're here for eight. Seven arms are straight. Six. Four. Two. One. And rest. Excellent. All right. 
Heels together, toes apart, feet in a small V. We step out to the right, arms reach out to the side, then we pull all the way back in. Here we go, we take it out, in, out, in. How wide of a step can you take with your right foot? Keep your shoulders pushing down your back. Whew. Keep your arms nice and straight. Four, three, two. Now hold this one down. We bend the elbows in and out, in and out. You've got it. Let's add a pulse. We take it down. Down. Woo. Little tiny pulse so the legs never straighten. We're here for four, three, two. Hold it bent. Hold it bent. Right leg to the left elbow. Down. Up. Down. You got it. Cross and down. Cross and down. Four more. For four. Two, and one, excellent. Step your heels together, keep the arms less like this. We step out to the left, we close, then open. Close, then open, you got it. Down, and down, and how low can you sit your seat? As you reach your elbows towards one another, even if they don't actually touch. Four more, four, Three, two, now hold this one down, hold it down. We press up, down, up, down. Let's add those legs, we take it up, down. Eight more for eight, woo! You can do this everybody, keep pushing. Four, Two, now hold it down, open the arms. We touch and lower. Touch and lower. Touch, lower. Four more, here we go. For four, three, two, one. Excellent. Shake out those arms, we're not done yet, but give those shoulders a shake. Heels together, toes apart, feet in a small V. We curl and stretch, curl and stretch. Let's add a bend, we bend and stretch, bend and stretch. Whew. Four more, we're here for four, three, two, hold it down, lower the arms halfway. Pulse, out, out. So this time, instead of the wrist being in line with your shoulders, your wrists stay in line with your hip bones. Pulse, pulse, you've got it, pulse. The knees are staying bent, you're squeezing your seat. Knees pushed out to the sides. Eight, seven, four, three, now hold them out, little tiny squeezes in, in. So half of the squeeze, Small range of motion, let's add a pulse with the legs. Pulse down, pulse down, you've got it. Heels are still together, tiny pulse here. Eight, seven, you can do this. Four more, four more for four. Three, two. Now hold it down, the arms drop. Down, lift up to the side, down and up, down. Side. Let's add a forced arch. We take it down, forced arch, down, forced arch, down, and up. Four more. Here we go for four, three, two. This time, hold it to the side. Tiny squeeze in, in. So again, just a small range of motion. Let's add a pulse. Here we go. So we're fighting for our balance in that four starch. Adding the small pulse, squeezing your seat. Shoulders press down. 
We've got eight more. Here we go for eight, seven, woo. four, two, one. Lower the heel, straighten the legs, arms press to the side. We straighten overhead, bend. You're almost there. This is the last little bit of our arms. You can do this. Let's add a releve. We hit it up, then down, up, and down. You've got it. Four more. We're here for four. Three. Now straighten and bend your arms. Stretch the arms, bend the arms. Stretch the arms, bend the arms. Let's add a bend of our knees. We bend the knees and stretch. We bend and stretch. You've got it. Four. Two, let's put it together. One up, one out. We take one up, one out. One up, one out. Last four. This is it. Four. Down. Three. Down. Two. Down. One more. One. And done. Woo! All right. Place your dumbbells to the side. We don't need them until the very end for our abs. Grab your socks. So if you need socks to slide, grab your socks, put them on your feet. We're going to start in a parallel position. I'm gonna face the side so you can see, but right now I'm facing front, parallel position. The front leg, the leg that's closest to the camera, which is my left, but it can be whichever leg it is for you, is going to slide back. Just the feet down and up. Slide back down and up. Let's take two more this speed. Down and up. Down. Let's take it to the tempo. Here we go. Down, up, down, up. So the whole time my shoulders are staying over my hips. I'm sliding as low as I can. Back knee drops low. Now, if you would like to use the arms, same arm that slides, same arm as leg that slides back, comes forward. You've got it. We've got four more. Four. Two, now hold this one down. Hold it down. Pulse it here. Pulse. Pulse. you got it. Pulse. Now, if you'd like, you can bring the arms overhead. If the arms start to feel like too much, you can always bring them back to your hips. Either way, both hip bones facing the same way you're facing. Shoulders over your hips, lower abdominals are pulled in. Eight, seven. Four more, here we go for four. Three, two, now Hold it down, shift your weight forward, point the back foot, slide the leg in and out. Now notice my standing leg is bent. I'm just sliding the back leg in and out. I've even turned my foot over, so I'm sliding on the tops of my toes. How low can you keep the standing leg bent? There's very little weight on this back leg. You got this, everybody. Four, three, two. Now hold this one back. Pulse down, pulse down. So your standing leg is pulsing. The back leg is straight. It's only moving because your standing leg is pulsing so much. We're here for eight, seven. Four, two, now hold it down. Lift the back leg up, tap it down. Lift up, tap it down. So now 100% of your weight is in your bent standing leg. Hold it bent, you can do it. Pulse it, bring it up. Down, up, down. Four more, fight for that balance. Three, two, now hold this one up. Hold it up, standing leg only, pulse down. So notice this leg, 
My back leg is not moving. My entire body is moving. That's what makes it look like the back leg's moving, but really, my standing leg's moving, which moves my whole body. Eight, seven, four, two, one, whoo! Shake out that leg. Excellent, excellent, excellent job. We've got one side down, one side left to go. I'm gonna turn to face my other side. I again start with my feet parallel. My front leg, which is my right leg, slides all the way back, in, back, in. So you know where we're going now. Feel free to use those arms if you'd like, or you can keep the arms right on your hips. Either way, back and drop, low, up, low, up. Keep your shoulders stacked over your hips. Your ribs are knit together. Down, up. We've got four more. Here we go for four, three, two. Hold this one down, hold it down, pulse it down. Pulse, pulse. Option if you'd like to bring the arms overhead. Either way, that back leg is pulsing. Down and down. Shoulders are still back. Abdominals are still pulled in. Ribs are still knit together. Eight, seven, four, two, now hold it down, shift your weight forward, point that back foot, pull the leg in, out, in, out. Notice again, standing leg stays bent. There's very little weight in this back leg. I'd say about 5%, maximum 10% in the leg that's moving. 80 to 90% of your weight is in the standing leg. And it stays as bent as you can. Maybe you can get a little lower. Whew. We're here for four, three. Hold it back, pulse it down, pulse. So again, the standing leg is pulsing. The back leg is moving, but only as a result of the standing leg pulsing down so much. Woo, you got it, pulse, pulse. We're here for four, three, two, hold it down, lift that leg. Up, tap, up, tap. So again, standing leg stays bent. Don't worry about the height of the leg that's moving. It's all about shifting 100% of your weight into the standing leg. So even if it just comes a tiny bit off the floor, that's the whole point of it. We've got four more. Four, three, two, hold it up, hold it up. Standing leg, pulse it down, down, you've got it, down, down. You're almost there, you can do this, push, push. Fight for your balance. We're here for eight, seven, four, two, one. Oh my gosh, shake up those legs. Whew. All right, we've got one thigh exercise left. This is when we're gonna go over to a wall. So I'm gonna change where my camera is facing. So I'm gonna go over to this wall. All right, so you're going to place your back flat up against the wall, your feet are going to step out so that you can slide your feet down. So if you're on a slippery surface, clearly I am, you might have to take off your socks for this one because my feet were sliding. And they're still sliding, but it's okay. So back is flat. My hips are as close to knee level as I can, and I'm gonna glue my thighs together. So we're here, we pulse it straight down, down, down. You got it, pulse, pulse. So I'm squeezing my lower abdominals in so that my entire back stays flat against the wall. We've got eight more like this for eight, seven, four, 
Two now, hold it down. Thighs open, close, open, close. So now my feet stay together. So my thighs can only open as much as I can rotate without moving my feet. Out, in, out, in. You got it, out and in. I can feel my inner thighs firing up. You've got this, everybody. Pull those abs in. Push your low back down to your wall. We're here for eight, seven. Four more, here we go for four. Two, hold this one down. One heel lifts, one heel lifts, other heel lifts, one heel lifts, other heel lifts. Switch and switch. Keep those abdominals pulling in. Keep even the lowest part of your back glued into your wall. Eight, seven, four more. Here we go for four. Two. Now both heels up, both heels down, both heels up, both heels down. Keep the thighs glued together. You got it. Up and down. You want to feel that shape. You want to feel the quiver of your thighs as you fight to keep your knees bent. We're here for four. Two, hold this one up. Hold it up, pulse it down. Pulse, pulse, you got it. Down, down. We're almost there, you can do this everybody. Woo! Legs are shaking, feet are shaking. We've just got eight more counts, here we go for eight, seven, four, two, one, oh, whoo! All right, shake out those thighs. Let's actually give them a quick stretch. So hold on to your wall, whatever you're nearby. Grab your right foot with your right hand, knees together, push your hips forward. Woo. And switch. Grab your left foot with your left hand, knees together, push your hips forward. All right, let's get into our seat. We're gonna actually go down to the mat for this one. So I'm gonna return this. Da -da. Perfect. All right, so we're going to come onto our side. We place our right elbow down. Knees are stacked, hips are stacked. Front hand is down. We bend the knees, lift the top leg. Up, down, up, down. So we're working on the outside of our seat. Now notice, my kneecap is facing the camera. So avoid pulling your knee in towards your shoulder. We want the hips to stay stacked. So it's a smaller range of motion, which is totally fine. Lift and up. We've got eight more like this for eight, seven, six, four more, four, Two, now hold it up, flex the foot, extend to the front, bend the knee, extend to the front, bend the knee, extend, bend, extend, bend. So notice my knees are still far apart from one another. My shoulders are pushing down, kicking my leg as straight as I can. We're almost there, you got it. Stretch. Four more. Four. Two. Now hold this leg straight. Pulse it up. 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 Keep your leg as straight as you can. Keep your energy out of the heel of your foot. Eight. Seven. Four, two, we're almost there, last little bit. Knee comes into your elbow. Pull it in, kick it out, pull it in, kick it out. You can do this. 
pull, kick. Eight, seven, this is the last little bit. You've got to stick it down. Four, two, one, Woo. rest. All right, let's give that side a quick stretch before we go over to the other side. So take that foot that you just worked, place it over the other leg, either stand tall and push that knee down. If the leg is already down, start to walk the arms out. Ooh, feel the stretch in that seat. Excellent. All right, let's take it over to the other side. So again, elbow down, hand down, hips are stacked, legs are stacked. We lift the leg up, down, up, down. So immediately notice if that knee starts to come close to your shoulder. That just means you're letting the hip open a bit. So push the hip forward and keep the outside of your leg facing the ceiling. Up, up. You've got it, lift. We're here for eight, seven. Four more, four. Two, hold it up, hold it up, straighten and bend. Stretch, bend, stretch, bend. You've got it, out, in. How straight can you kick that top leg? Kick it, extend. Woo, you've got it, push. Eight. Four more, here we go, for four. Two, hold it out, flex the foot and pulse it up. Pulse, pulse. Keep your shoulder away from your ear. Notice if you start to sink down. Keep that energy pressing down into the mat. Eight more counts right here for eight, seven. Four, last little bit knee to your elbow, pull it out, kick. All of that energy kicks out through the heel so your leg gets all the way straight in, out. Last eight, here we go. We're here for eight, seven, Woo. Four more, four more. Two, one, rest. Woo. All right, take that leg over the opposite leg. Walk your arms forward. Oh. That's as far forward as I can go. <laughs> Woo. All right, we've just got abs and a stretch left to go. Grab your dumbbells or your bottles, whatever you are holding. Feet stay flat, hinge backwards, arms come out to the side. I twist to the right and left, so I twist. Right, center, left, Let's take it to tempo. We twist. Right, left. Right, left. So I'm keeping the hinge of my body. Shoulders and hips in the same line. Lower abdominals pulled in tight. Four, three, two. Hold it center. Opposite elbow to knee. Touch it down. Opposite elbow to knee. A little faster. We touch, center, touch, center. You got it, touch. Eight, seven. Four more, here we go for four. Two, one, arms pull in, right elbow back. Take it to center. Left elbow back. Now tempo, here we go. Touch, touch, reach, pull. You got it. How close can you get your elbow to the floor behind you? Reach, pull. Four more, we're here for four. 
two. Now arms open and close. Open, close. Fly, open, close. Fly, and close. Four more. Four. Two. Hold this one open. Close the arms. Lift the legs. Twist. One. Two. Twist. Twist. You got it. Twist. Twist. We've got eight more. Here we go. We're here for eight. Seven. Four more, four, two, one, and rest. All right, place those dumbbells down. We've just got a nice quick stretch left to go. Tuck your toes under, shoot your hips to the ceiling, pedal out your feet. Push one heel back, other heel back. Lift your right leg towards the ceiling. Bend the knee, open the hip. Pull that same leg forward into your pigeon. Walk your arms as far forward as you can. Then push up to your hands. Reach your right arm back. Pull that back knee towards your hip. And release. Tuck the toes under, shoot your hips back to the ceiling. This time, lift your left foot to the ceiling. Bend the knee, open the hip. Pull that leg forward into your pigeon and walk your arms forward. And push up to your hands. Reach your left arm back. Bend your knee, grab your foot, pull it in. And release. Tuck those toes under, shoot your seat towards the ceiling. Bend both knees, walk your hips all the way in. Slowly roll up, vertebrae by vertebrae. We'll take one last big deep breath in. And out. And that's class. Thank you guys so much for joining in. And if you tuned in later, thank you for joining me. And I'll see you guys in the next one. I don't remember when it is, but I'll make sure to post it on my stories. Bye.